Runners, set, go! This is only one lap, so you can let it go and go very fast. There are several runners that are that are very fast, that are team leaders, but uh, uh, my philosophy is the important thing is personal records. So for example, if I have a runner who's running a 13 minute pace uh, and they do a race where they run a 12 minute pace, that's the important thing. I had a runner some years ago in the freshman year, he was the last on the team, in his senior year he was the second on the team. A lot of us come from different parts of the school, different academies, and different grades. And so I love how we get to interact with each other, and especially for the upperclassmen to you know, help out and support their peers. One thing I like about being on the cross country team here at South is I really like the family aspect of it. Everyone helps each other out and everyone's looking out for everyone else's best interest. They all have the potential to be great and they all will get greater and uh, uh, this is my sixth season coaching and uh, I've seen it every single year. Kids that don't look they can, like they can run 50 feet, they, they do it. They run five, six, seven miles. We have 10 meets this year. We'll be running against North, interestingly, because of the way the schedule works, three times. And they have a very, a very good team. And we open against St. Peter Marion, and they have uh, two of the fastest girl runners in the state are on the St. Peter Marion team, so that's going to be exciting. We're opening here against them. But uh, uh, we'll be running at Clinton, and Clinton's got a terrific course down by the dam. I really like going out there. All of the runners like it. It's challenging, but it's beautiful. Our course is probably the toughest in the state. So it's hard to break new runners in because they're running on a very hard course. But once they do get broken in, it helps because when people visit here, they don't have the advantage of practicing on this course. We have a benefit race on the 23rd of October, a big race that's held here, It's uh, this will be our fifth year. Uh, and this year we, re we, na we renamed it the Nick Kanarankis Benefit Memorial Race, Benefit Race. He was a South High grad that ran every previous race. He did 40 marathons. Of course, as you know, one of the captains as, and with any team, we'd love to win. 
of course. But even more than winning, what means more to me than that is to see everyone supporting each other, um, to seeing, to have people get personal records and to push beyond what they think they can do. I mean, cross country is about long distance running, but I think the long distance running is only, for me, it's a vehicle to instill in the, uh, in the students uh, confidence, to show them that they can do something extremely difficult and that they can improve at it, that they can become competent and that they can have camaraderie. And I think that's why this team has grown from six runners to almost 40. <laughs> I don't even know if I like running. I think I just like the rewards of running. Like, you know, I just did that kind of thing. The, the running itself is painful, I will admit. Um, I'm still doing it four years later, so that says something. But I think it's like one of those lovely relationships. Last year, I really got into track. You know, that has some running in it, and I guess I really wanted to, you know, join cross country now to keep me in shape for track. Uh, you know, track isn't a, uh, it's not a fall sport, so it's not on right now, but I think cross country is a really good way to uh, stay in shape. I do like running long distance. I feel like it's rewarding, and it's, it's just a fun experience, you know, to be out there with everybody else and to, you know, just have a nice long time where you can be out running. been practicing running with my sister and we usually ran like two miles but um, I heard that on the cross-country team we run like three and a little bit more sometimes so I was like maybe I could push myself maybe I could actually do it I like that you're going outside and getting to a final destination you just see like all of nature and you get to see different places Running itself is really hard, but I like when like you feel like really good when you finish a race or like you finish something that you've been working on or like you run up a hill. Like that part is really fun. It shows you a lot about yourself. You learn about how far you can go. You learn how far you can push yourself and others that are with you. last year and it was in like really bad conditions it was pouring rain and it was freezing and everyone was just like dreading the race but we all ended up getting our fastest times because of the conditions we were in and like the faster you run the faster you get out of it so we did really well last year i would say it was my first practice and that's actually the first time i've ever run ever and i just sort of fell in love with running uh, my district race last year in November, it was really cold, it snowed when we got there. We got there and it was snowing and I was like, oh my goodness, this is going to be awful. And it was. It was really, really cold running and we were running in this. It was very chilly, and but I dropped five minutes off of my personal record, so I was really happy about that. Uh, my favorite moment was last year at districts. Probably because it was the most painful moment, because it was so cold. It was snowing, you know, right before the race. And even though it was so painful, that make, that's what makes it memorable. And uh, to remember us finishing the race, being strong, and finally finishing for that cup of hot chocolate. <laughs>
is a painful sport and it's really hard. It's competitive, but then at the same time we still have respect for each other. Running itself is really hard. Running is actually really challenging and I like how even though like it's not one of those sports that you have to be especially gifted in, you just have to try really hard and eventually everyone can get good at running. And cross country is a really good way to uh, stay in shape. I thought it was <laughs> It was the, the running itself is painful, I will admit. Um, I'm still doing it four years later, so that says something.